Hardware Canucks CES coverage is made possible by our partner NVIDIA. It is also made possible thanks to Corsair, Fantex and NCIX. The ASUS GT51 gaming desktop really caught our eyes at CES because while it is very gaming centric in the physical character, it is also a great shift away from the type of case designs gamers are starting to build with now. And so I'd like to ask our audience on what you think of this type of case design with a comment below. First, the front panel has a lot going for it. This glowing portal at the bottom is obviously an air intake that features multicolored lighting with brief breathing red strips uh, above it with the ROG logo. If they were trying to achieve this type of robotic and armored chassis feel to it, they have done a fantastic job, let me tell you, and it kind of grows on you, almost makes me want to build inside one of these cases. It is angled with very busy side panel, I mean they have perforated ventilation which is not dust proof unfortunately, we have an angular window with honeycomb design mesh underneath it, and this extra layer of aerodynamic side panel. And it almost makes you feel like it's way too much, but at the same time, totally suiting the aesthetics of what they're trying to achieve. On the inside, they have a Skylake CPU, dual Titan Nexus, nice clean cable management, and a non-black interior surface, which was a bummer. This is 2016 after all. Come on, the GPUs are supported with custom brackets to prevent sag with a simple ROG branded all-in-one and uh, this breathing interior lighting. Now, the one particular feature I found truly unique is this NFC armband that may introduce new security and overclocking features to how we interact with our computer cases. It's quite low profile, it is of course RGB branded, and when touched at the front of the case, it unlocks a certain shadow partition, which is inside your case, where you stash away your private stuff and files and documents or hold it there for five seconds to overclock your machine to a specific profile which sounds really awesome with potential to add so many extra functions to the brand uh, for these rog specific commands now what i'm interested to see if asus will sell the enclosure separately because despite this design that is totally not my style i am weirdly drawn towards it for you know some maybe fun experimentation so let us know if you share similar interest as me or do you find it totally unappealing i'm dimitri with hard rock canucks thanks so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video